All right, guys, so today we do have my foot champs rewards, and sorry, I didn't get a live recording of this as I was actually talking to my mates. But we got 10 wins in the end, which was one off the 11, and our first red pick was okay as we got Soloth. I've heard he's meant to be really good because of the lengthy matter. As you can see, I was looking at his stats here. You know, they don't seem the best for most FIFAs, but because he's lengthy, he's meant to be quite good. Second red pick... To be honest, I just wanted Musiala, and I did not get him. We got Soloth again, and I believe I took James Madison from this, and I was thinking maybe DeMarcos because he's an okay right back, but we ended up going for Madison in the end. So, you know, overall, the red picks, they're okay, to be honest, and we go on into the tradable packs. Now this is where it started to heat up. 50K pack and a 100K pack tradable. In the 50K pack, I open it. Oh my god, it's a special card. Nigeria, who's that? And then we go and get ourselves Simon. I was thinking, oh, that's a sick super sub, but I already have like 15 left wingers for some reason. Here we go. Who are we going to get? We got Tang Miao and Simon, which at the time I was quite happy about because I was tempted to buy Team of the Season Simon. For a substitute, as you can see there, I selected Simon. Obviously not Tang Miao. But, you know, he's tradable. He might sell for something. Rest of the pack was average. We didn't get anyone too great in there. I mean, I guess Allen is good at a stretch. Um, we go and discard the duplicates. I can't be bothered listing them up, to be honest. Probably a mistake. Later on in the year, if I get low on coins, I'll probably start lifting them up. But as you'll see by one of the pack pulls we get after this, we're going to be on a lot of coins. But yes, yeah, Simon can actually play striker as one of his positions, so he's going to be really good if I need to use a league one team or something. 100k pack now. And just watch what we got. Walk out. Egypt. Oh my god, guys. We got Mohamed Salah. I've already got Ronaldo. I was honestly not sure whether I should sell him or not, but then I looked at the price and it was like 240k. Um, right now, I was pretty hyped. Um, yeah, I didn't really know how to react because the second I packed him, I, I wasn't sure if it was like 500k, 100k, because the agility thing isn't a meta, isn't as meta. But yeah, he is still 240k, so we take it. A lot of duplicates in that pack. You know, once again, probably should be listing them up. But we just discarded them instead. Send Sard of the transfer list to sell later. Um, Simon ended up going back into the club because I think we just sent him to the transfer list before. And now we get on into the tradable team of the week pack. Again, I was hoping for either Musiala or Vauna. Obviously, Haaland is what we really want. But those are the two cards I'd like first owner. We get a walkout. Germany. Left mid, Vauna. Very, very solid card. The main one I did want was Musiala, as I, ooh, as I have him in my team. That is a bit of a spoiler for later on in the video. Vauna, still a very solid card, though. Worth a decent amount of coins, but I believe we did send him to the club because I'm pretty sure he's on my bench right now. Discard the other two. Once again, probably should list them or keep them in the club for later. But, yeah, that was very, very solid. And now I'll cut forward to showing you guys my team. All right, so my voice might be a little bit messed up. But, as you can see, this is the team that we used in Foot Champs. Uh, very solid. The main differences are we got Bellingham in, Gnabry, Sterling, Musiala, Dalo, and Jordi Alba. So, to be honest, we pretty much changed the whole team. Uh, from Foot Champs Rewards, uh, you would have seen we got Salah and... Vana, I think Simon was from them from for champs as well. But yeah, now we've got 550k roughly. So let me know any upgrades you'd like to see in this team. And I have to say, I have access to my Ganabri to Glory account now. So could be getting an episode once every week there, or once every two weeks, something like that. But um, yeah, guys, just want to say this Musiala, very good. That's his record for qualifiers and for champs. Very solid considering he was playing Cam. The other ones are all ruined because of a bit of squad battles for objectives. Sterling's is meh because he came off the bench for me. I have to say Gakpo was very good as well off the bench. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Alright guys. Well, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, maybe we can have a Gnabry to Glory soon. 
Um, but yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.